Hey guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. Today's video is how to make this amazing, simple, high growth oil that you can use to regrow bald spots, thicken your hair, and essentially uh, promote faster high growth. So if you're interested, you definitely want to be sure to keep on watching and watch till the end of the video so you get to see all of the steps and also instructions on how to use it. Now before we get into it guys, I just want to say thank you so much to all of you guys who have been patiently waiting for content. I know I haven't been as consistent as I have been in the past, but we're working on it guys, okay? We're definitely working on it. There is a reason and I will come out and tell you guys when the time is right. But at the moment, please bear with me as I try my best to put out content for you guys. So here it is. So let's hop into the video. So this contains, I'll say three ingredients or two main ingredients. So the first one will be some fresh aloe vera leaves, just like you can see here guys. Now aloe vera is great for our hair and also for our scalp. Now scalp health is so, so important when it comes to stimulating high growth and just having healthy hair in general. Um, apart from, you know, aloe vera giving you great scalp condition, it also helps to stimulate hair growth. It's full of vitamins and antioxidants that do help in that process. And also it helps to moisturize the hair and keep it nice and healthy. So if you don't have fresh aloe vera, just like I have here, I don't know what else you can use, but I would say probably just use the next ingredient on its own, but I would prefer you use the aloe vera as well. So after cutting it into smaller pieces, just like I did there guys, we are going to go in next with some amla powder. Now amla powder again is great great for hair because it conditions your scalp it also helps to promote healthy hair growth it improves the tone of um of your hair it minimizes grays it boosts volume so it gives your hair really nice and um, good thickness and it also helps to reduce dandruff so really good in general so i added about one tablespoon of amla powder for this amount of aloe vera that i used now as you can see here i'm just adding some olive oil but it's okay to use any other oil of choice. It could be red seed oil, coconut oil if you're not allergic to it. So stir that well and then we're going to do the double boiler method essentially. Instead of putting it directly to the pan, um, we're going to do the double boiler method so we can preserve as much nutrients as we can from this. Now I have done the one that you put on the pan. Um, straight away in the past, but I have used oils that are a little bit more resistant to heat um, So if you are going to put it directly in the pan So things like rapeseed oil or coconut oil like organic raw coconut oil would be great options But if you're using olive oil, please do the double boiler method so you can retain as much nutrients as possible So after it's done you will know it's ready when the aloe vera has turned from that bright green color to this sort of darker green color and that's how you know it's ready so we're going to go ahead and strain this you guys already know what's coming so it's my regular paper towel for my kitchen and it does the job but feel free to use any other thing that you have available Now after straining it guys, this is it. This is our oil, pretty nice and ready. Now I do have a little bit of the amla powder at the bottom, but that's okay. Before you use it, just stir and combine as much as you can um, before applying it. Um, so yeah, essentially that's all done. You just want to pop it in like a little container that you're going to use to keep your oil and then we're ready to apply. Baby. I know this might sound insane Okay 
guys so in this part of the video I'm going to share with you how you can use this now I'm starting on a pretty old um, twist out my hair at the moment is really flat it's really tangled at the bottom and yeah it does need you know some like proper detangling and I just haven't got around to doing it as yet but um, I just want to show you basically how you can use this it is very very simple and you can use it in pretty much um, move your hair in pretty much any state it could be in braids conros protector style like anything that you've got really or even tangled hair just like I have here um, so it's very simple all you need to do is just you know apply it to your scalp if you've got thin areas or thin or let's say like bald patches that you're trying to regrow you can definitely just apply to that area um, essentially now I'm going to work it through the my entire scalp here essentially and then I'm going to also apply to my edges um, because obviously we're trying to get you know this thick and full edges now in case you're wondering how often you should be using this um, I would say this oil is definitely uh, light enough to use um, twice or three times a week um, if you want to obviously use as much as you need to um, everybody's hair is completely different some people's hair can retain oil for quite a long time so in that case you don't really need to reapply um, but obviously if your hair doesn't really retain oil then you may need to apply a little bit more often um, so essentially after I've applied this to my scalp including my edges I'm just gonna go ahead and basically just massage my scalp now if you've been working with me for a while you will probably um, get used to me saying this all the time when it comes to like oils and scalp massages it is just great at you know increasing the blood flow to the scalp area which brings more nutrients to your follicles essentially and helps to promote hair growth um, it's always a great way to um, speed up hair growth in general um, so after that that's pretty much it guys it is very simple let me know what you think about um, this video have you tried this oil before and if you have what are your thoughts um yeah let me know in the comment section down below like the video and subscribe if you're not already and i'll catch you next time bye